Hi, Jeff Howard here at KiteBoarding.com and FixMyKite.com. We're going to describe to you some of the great little utensils and things that can be used to get your kites back into working condition from 2010 and get ready for the season. Or if you're getting ready to travel to go do some of your kiteboarding, some of the great um, items that we have that uh, make it very, very handy to keep you on the water at all times. The micro hook braiding tool, you can look online, there's also a video describing this. Using this small tool and the extender line and the instructions, if you break a fly line, fly lines, most of them are braided now, 90% of them are, and they can be put back together with this tool. So you're not needing to replace that line, you can actually braid it back together using the micro hook braiding tool. The other thing that can be used as a wear and tear at the end of your fly lines is the sleeving at the ends. We provide a sleeving kit. Sleeving kit, you get the sleeving wire, uh, four sleevings, and then the uh, bag to hold everything. Online it shows how these can be put back on. Very, very simple. Uh, it, you can cut your lines off even, install four new line ends, and it teaches you in there how to tie them to get you back on the water. In most cases, if you find some place that can be sewn, get them sewn, but they can also be tied if done correctly. The other thing we have is pigtail sets. Using the kook proof pigtail set, this comes in a set of a total of eight, Four goes on your fly lines and four go on your kite. They have uh, four knotted and uh, four just loop to loop. Using these reduces all the wear and tear on the ends of your fly lines. These are simple to replace, should be replaced at least every year, uh, maximum every two years to cut down the wear and tear. Uh, again, if something breaks, swimming in is definitely no fun. Um, you have the universal pigtails. These come in a uh, bunch of different colors. We make these here and they can be installed either direction we call them universal as this can be larks headed onto the kite on this end and you can have a knot or you can do it the other direction and actually larks head this end onto the kite or your fly line and have a loop on the end to connect so it can be used either way for any of those pigtails if you need them and extensions and take all the wear and tear off your fly lines the next thing you have that a lot of people overlook is the pulleys kite pulleys these wear out very very often getting a lot of sand up inside of them and replacing these at least every year, two years maximum. Keep your eye on these because if you break a pulley, that definitely is almost a guaranteed swim in and that's a long swim and also the loss of control of your kite. So keep a close eye on all of your pulleys and system on, bridle system on your kite. We also have these which are called the PKS pull, uh, pulley savers. These can be installed, again look at the video, these are installed around the pulley itself and are basically there as a preventative measure. If the, if the pulley does break, this can catch the fly or the bridle line and at least get you back into shore without losing the loss of control of your kite. It comes in a set of four, very, very simple to install and um, worth, its, worth its price in gold for sure if and when you do break a pulley. The other things that we provide is a sail tape. These can be bought, in the, these can be bought by the foot or by the roll. Um, very easy to install onto the kite, a tear up to about five inches, clearly out into the cell. This is the best thing to use, making sure that the cell is clean and dry, placing a patch on the front and the back that match. This can get you uh, back on the water and going in no time at all. It is actually a fabric with tape. The clear uh, or white, what we call it, the backing is usually what you see there, is virtually clear, so almost any color other than black, uh, use the clear on it or the white and that comes out. You can buy these in a roll of 25 feet or by the foot from us. There's also the Dacron, three inch Dacron. This can be used on your wingtip Dacron areas or the leading edge in a very small rip area. Again, a leading edge, if it, if it has a cell, uh, has a rip into it or a tear or a cut exceeding an inch to two inches maximum, you will definitely want to get that stitched and sewn and taken care of right away. But the Dacron can get you, uh, keep you on the water and get you riding. Uh, this can be bought by the foot. Um, the next thing is Tear Aid. Tear Aid is a very, very easy uh, item to use. It sticks on virtually almost any material on the kite, either the sail or the leading edge or even the bladder itself. Once the Tear Aid is on, it does not come off. So to correctly fix a tear um, after you've used this tape, we actually have to do a panel replacement and remove the tape uh, residue because it will not come off of the kite. But if you're out somewhere and you want to get back on the water after a tear, Tear Aid is great. It's sold by the foot as well as um, the six inch patches, which can repair bladders, kites, uh, the material, leading edge, or anything else on the kite. But again, it is not a permanent fix. It uh, will stretch out and uh, decolor, but it can get you back on the water quick and fast. The other thing we have is 
the chicken loop lines. We have this in quarter inch and uh, next size down on that, I think it was the 3 8 We make these in provided chicken loop lines pre-made. This is for the best uh, replacement chicken loop lines. They come with a stainless steel ring and the line uh, that will fit almost any of their models at any length is going to be cut off. It also has a pull on it which allows you to pull through the stopper, through the chicken loop, easy to install and quick. A good thing to have in your bag uh, just in case and when you do need it. Um, again, we can do this by the foot or we can make anything you'd like us to make. Here at FixMyKite.com we have all the machines and can do anything like that if you like. The other item we have is, a, is the replacement valves, stick down valves. If you need these, we have them in every size and every shape and model here at FixMyKite.com. The self-stick valves. We make them in all different models. We have the slingshot one pump system. We have a dump valve. We have inflate and uh, inflate stopper valves. Anything you may need. We also have the bladders, struts, everything. Can teach you. Has all the videos on how to install your nipple and also get a new strut or leading edge installed into your kite. Get these things fixed up. If you start having a problem, give us a call. We can help you in uh, making sure they're correct. You get the correct valve as well as the correct installation. The other thing we have is a um, sewing awl. Sewing awls are a great handy item to have in your kit. This comes in the KiteBurning.com Ultimate Repair Kit. You have basically almost everything on this line that we've talked about in this Ultimate Repair Kit. But the sewing awl can be used to sew your uh, any thick thing back together such as your harness or your straps or you know just a nylon you can also if you ever had to I've done it on my kite down at the wing tips of stitching things back together to get myself back on the water it's a hand sewing all a great little device again look on the website for that uh, the kiteboarding.com fix kits we have a very small one this is a great travel one that's just a stick in your pocket of your bag and uh, it has tear aid it uh, Dacron cell tape and makes it very easy to get you back on for the small cuts and tears and things. Easy to have. Again, the KiteBrain.com fix kit. Then we have the uh, KiteBrain.com ultimate repair kit. This is an amazing little packet that we have. You can see it online to see everything that's inside of it. This little bag can be carried, just thrown into your travel bag. Sewing all, uh, leader line, tear rate, cell, cell repair, the micro hook braiding tool, sleeving kit, and pigtails, everything ready to go. It's a great item, an excellent gift. We had these were very, very popular at Christmas time. But uh, look online, you can see everything that's supplied in this kit and ready to go in the box. The other thing we have is we have the kite fix repair kits. These are a, a great item that we sell for people who travel. If you're stuck somewhere and need to glue your cell back together or get it all put in there, again, we don't consider it a permanent fix, it's just a great traveling type item to get it fixed back up, glue it back together, but if your kite comes in for a professional repair, we will remove that section of where the glue is, but it's a great thing to get you back on. It's a waterproof uh, kit, comes with scissors, marker, and the whole process of how to use the, uh, the kite fix kit, just in case if you need it and you're out in the middle of nowhere. Other than that, we have every bridle you can ever imagine. If you need to replace your bridles of any of your fly lines or uh, on, your, on your bridle on the kite, we have it uh, in the leader line where you're usually where your pulley moves. We can make these to any length if anyhow. If you look on the website, we have it in a bunch of different colors. This is the Spectra leader type line. It comes from the bar or on the bridle. As well as we have bridle lines. These can be stitched to any length. Again, on the website, we describe on how to measure these and let us know, but we can replace any bridle line on any kite in the market. Again, at Jeff Howard here at KiteBoarding.com and FixMyKite.com. We've got everything you need to get you back on the back on the water for 2010. Let us know if we can help you out.